truth. You know the truth. Yes. Wait a minute, Father. You're not going to tell him about those mine shafts. I must tell the truth, Bill. The church doesn't accept miracles without investigating them carefully. It's my duty to tell them. It's your duty to take the light out of their faces, is it, Father? I saw them when it happened. I saw those poor, bitter faces shining as if someone had turned a light on inside them. And I heard them giving thanks to somebody who had turned the statues. Now you're going upstairs and ask them to thank a couple of basement pillars and a piece of broken ground. Look, Father Paul, maybe I want a miracle because I'm a press agent, but I'm not thinking of putting over a movie now. Whoever turned those statues wasn't trying to sell a picture for Marcus Harris. I tell you, Father, God was trying to say, life's all right. It's not as bad as it seems. And I'm up here watching and trying to help. And if he didn't say it, if nobody up there said it, don't you see, Father, it's been said. Because it's in their hearts now. It'll go out all over the world. And if God doesn't speak like that out of heaven, he'll be speaking out of people's hearts. And what's the difference where he speaks from? Your job isn't to hide his word, is it? No, it isn't to hide his word. The saints came to Joan of Arc because she believed in God and wanted to help someone. The people of France. Olga believed in God just as much. She wanted to help the people of Coal Town just as much. Give her the chance, Father Paul. Come with me, Bill. 